Well, hello and thank you for joining me. So, what have we got today? It's going to be some form of radio cassette with some form of damage. Either the radio is not working or the tape player isn't working properly or maybe both. But at the time of uh, opening, as usual, I don't actually know what this is. You will know because, of course, it will be in the, uh, in the video description by the time you see it. So this has literally just arrived. Um, as per a lot of the things on the channel at the moment, we've got a whole bunch of radio cassettes coming in that are broken or damaged in some way or inoperative. So we're gonna have some fun. So do please subscribe and um, we, shall, uh, we shall see how we get on with fixing some of these. So today is an unboxing video and then stay tuned and hit the notifications bell as well because what we'll be doing is plugging these in um, testing them, diagnosing any issues, and then going ahead and starting the uh, strip down and repair. So, first things first, what's in here? I'll just check the box quickly. It doesn't appear like there's anything else in there. So, sometimes there may be power cables and things like that. So, okay, here we go then. What do we have? Nice and steady, does it? And I'll try to save the uh, bubble wrap if I can. Ah, oh, I think, oh, I can see what this is straight away. It's got a very distinctive, um, very distinctive profile, this particular, this particular stereo. And I can tell you, it's a Sony CFS 47L. Now, I've actually got two of these now. Um, one of them is, working but not working if you like so the connect the cassette mechanism has completely had it and um, that's to be looked at for this particular one we don't know what works and what doesn't and i've literally bought this one it doesn't even power on apparently so the plan is we're going to take a look at this one see if we can get it working and hopefully it's something silly and if it is something silly like an internal fuse or Something in the power rail, as it were, then hopefully we'll be able to fix it and everything else will suddenly come to life. Now, that's uh, that might be a bit naive, but you never know. Whereas the other one I have does power on and the radio works, but the tape is completely uh, the mechanism's all sort of bent and jammed up, I think. Right, here we go then. It's nicely packaged, to be fair, for a broken unit. It's really nicely packaged. Now, oops, sorry, I just knocked the camera then, I think. Right, so here we are then. So here is the uh, the Sony CFS 47L. Um, actually, it's not in very, it's not in the best of conditions. It's all kind of grimy, I think, in there. Um, it might get clean up, I think, though. Um, you can see it's pretty, uh, it's pretty nasty but the eject mechanism does work at least. Um, there's been some heat damage or something along there, so I'm not sure if we'll be able to polish that out. Um, yeah, we'll have a look. So as I say, um, there'll be some work to do on this, and the first thing will be to sort of plug it in um, and diagnose any issues, see if we can even get it fired up first. So that'll be the first thing. So do please subscribe and hit the notifications bell, and we'll get on and start having a look at this in the very near future. In the meantime, thank you very much for watching. Do please check out the other videos. Um, I'm just starting to get to the point where I can, uh, I'm editing down some actual repair videos now. So do, do keep an eye out for those. And um, I shall see you soon. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.